Uh, good evening. Uh, today is the 14th of August uh, and uh, Independence Day of Pakistan and the day before Independence Day of India and I'm here in Rio. I just took in the cycling contest and I'm fixing to go home because I want to watch Usain Bolt in the 100 meters finals who comes in about another couple of hours and I have an hour long commute to go from here to uh, to my apartment in Leblon. So I'm just going to let the camera do the talking and have you taken this nighttime view. It is so unimaginative compared to how beautiful Brazil is. The lighting is really poor and uh, and they have absolutely no colors and there are no trees and uh, and this town this uh, even along the beach it's full of trees and as the New York Times pointed out uh, there are no benches to sit here anywhere it's so different from London and this is what they built from scratch uh, over 12 years or something like that so I don't know who these architects are but you know what they should be done with them so uh, it's hard to believe as a beautiful country as it is they wasted a, a great opportunity uh, to showcase but it's been well organized the transportation is very good uh, uh, no complaints uh, people are very polite and uh, and there are lots of volunteers who are very helpful uh, so all in all are good but but I think uh, I think Brazil was poorly served by the organizing committee of the Olympics uh, they were given an uh, opportunity on a golden platter and they threw it away c'est la vie